Hello, my name is Nigel. What's your name? Tariq. Tariq. Nice, nice meeting you, Tariq. Nice meeting okay. you. Okay, question for you. What are your thoughts on the afterlife? <laughs> so the afterlife for me is, I haven't thought enough about the afterlife because okay. how do you, how do you think about something that you don't know about? It's only what people tell you is how you speculate. That's okay. how I feel. Um, but so I, I don't know enough. You have not done enough research on that. Not enough research on that. Okay. If I was to die, I'd hope I'd hope I go to heaven or somewhere. Oh, so you've heard about heaven? Yeah, I've heard about heaven, yeah. Uh, okay. And uh, if you were standing next to God, you have died, God is here, you're standing there, and he's, hey, Terry, yeah. why should I allow you into my heaven? What would you say to him? I would say because I've been a good person. Okay. Uh, I always treat people with respect. I don't steal. I, don't, I, I, I do right by people, and I hope they do right by me. Okay. Yeah. All right. So. Uh, since you don't, you said you don't have much time. I'll try to be short. But uh, have you ever read the Bible? Ve not as much as I should. But so you've read a bit. Yeah, yeah, a bit, yeah. Okay. Uh, which Bible this? Can I give you Ephesians chapter two? It says what? Uh, not of works, lest any man should boast. Not of works, yeah. lest any man should boast. In other words, we are not... Okay, the answer is here. Can you read that? Oh, okay. Because you have, you have time. <laughs> Knowing that a man is not justified by the works of the law, or by, by the faith of Jesus Christ, even we have believed in Jesus Christ, that we might be justified by the faith of Christ, and not by the works of the law, for by the works of the law shall be flesh, shall no, shall no, no flesh, flesh be justified. justified. Okay, okay, I'll explain it. Um, the Bible is saying, your goodness cannot save you on the day of judgment. Okay. Because all of us, before God, we are guilty. Because we have all sinned. If I were to ask you some moral laws, uh, moral questions, like if you ever lied, chances are you have lied. Yeah. If you ever stolen anything big or small, chances are yes. Mm. I don't know, have you? I mean, a, 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 maybe a sweet when I a was sweet, <laughs> okay. you know, but yeah. a, a sweet yeah, still or even more being a bank before God, sin is sin. Oh, okay. There is no sin which is better than the other. If God says don't be a homosexual, he's mm -hmm. also saying don't lie. Yeah. A liar and a homosexual will go to the same hell. Because before him, sin, there is no sin which is better. Mm -hmm. Though we like to put sin in classes, but sin is sin. So in short, all of us guilty before him mm -hmm. we have all broken his laws or his commandments now because we have all sinned god sent us a savior jesus that is why where you read he says a man is only justified by jesus christ so okay. when you repent then you have access to enter heaven if you are born again Okay. So what is to repent? I myself, I used to womanize. I used to have many girls. Yeah. And I used to break hearts. I used to watch porn. But when I repented, I took my phone and I called all my girls. Hi. Hey, mm. Catherine, it was nice meeting you. Don't call me again. Bye. Yeah. Hi, Susan. Mm. Hi, Mary. Hi. I called all of them. Mm -hmm. Then I went further to call my, all my friends. Guys, from tomorrow I'm following Jesus. Mm -hmm. Because he says, if you repent, you must follow me. Okay. And when you follow me, live by command, one commandment, love. Because when you live in love, love is kindness, self-control. Wants to treat others like he wants to be treated. Where there's love, there's joy, there's peace, self-control, humility. I mean, everything that you can think of that is in God, love. Okay. That is the one commandment. That is when you become a Christian. Okay. Yeah. So Christianity, repentance, then you start to follow Jesus. Okay. Then you make it into heaven. But if you stand right now and you say, God, I've been good, then it means Jesus died in vain. Okay. Because you're saying, I was too good. I've done this and that. So I, Wild. yeah, yeah. You know. So okay. Jesus came because none of us could be right. You know, if you look at the commandments, not just the 10, there are also extra other commandments, civil laws. The children of Israel, they were given many laws. All those laws were to all of them when you look at them guilty okay because you broke them so any question for me before we go because it's no, no but i have learned more 
<laughs> in about five minutes than I have before, so I appreciate that. And uh-huh. I will definitely look into into this okay. more, and because uh, it makes sense. It makes sense, yeah? It makes sense, yeah. W- when do you think you'll repent? I think I need to, t- I think repent, I didn't realize I needed to, and now I realize yeah. I, I think I'll repent soon. Soon? Yeah, I think uh, so. Right. Well, soon. now, soon, as soon as I, <laughs> you know, as soon as I didn't realize, and now I understand more, I will repent. Okay. Very soon. Okay. So okay. Uh, process it, and yeah. uh, and I, I pray that you do it today. Of course, and I will look. Yeah, I will. I will. We, do it. I always uh, give people an example where I say, if we are in a plane mm. and we run out of fuel, and we are about to crash, if one turns up and say, "Hey, I've got two parachutes," mm. you will not say, "Hey, I will take that parachute when we have landed." Yeah, you, you say, take hey, it now. I, I, I so need you it give now. me the opportunity. So I'm gonna do it, take it now. Yeah. God comes to us at different times mm-hmm. because people check out at different times you don't need to be sick to die yeah sometimes you know what's happening uh, even in other parts of the world where people mm. have been bombed uh, anything can happen anytime mm-hmm. but you must always be repent yeah, yeah you yeah, know of so i can i just okay. pray for you as you go yeah yeah okay can so I, yeah. father i pray for my brother in the name of jesus christ and the things that we have uh, spoken about lord i pray that you give him understanding and uh, see a uh, makes a decision and uh, chooses to go into the bible i pray that you give him understanding i pray that you also lead him in a good bible believing church where you will meet like-minded people people who are hungry lead him in a, in a church where people are hungry for you lord so that he becomes the man you have called him to be to fulfill his assignment so that lord on the day of christ you say well done my servant you did your part i pray that you reveal who he is and so that he can uh, be busy in what you've called him to be what you've created him for in jesus mighty name i also pray father for good health bless the work of his hands give him favor even in in his company lord favor in jesus mighty name amen amen, amen. okay thank you yeah any questions for me no that's no that was amazing so thank you i'm gonna I'll definitely do my research look at your youtube i look forward to it. i'm gonna i'm gonna go do that now so. all right thank bless you very you. much yeah. okay. Okay. arise and shine for your light has come and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. And as you go, preach saying, The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Heal the sick, cleanse the lepers, raise the dead, cast out devils. Freely we have received, freely we give.